G'day everyone, Granitor here again with the uh, second game in the Faction Band Tournament between um, TWR Bobby and SH Grill and today it's the Nomad Bash so we've got um, Bobby bringing the Roxolani and we've got uh, Grill bringing the Masagate so uh, yeah, pretty even factions but um, I think the Roxolani pretty strong as well but yeah just depends on who brings what really they're, they're pretty well matched the same so Saka Cataphract Horse Archers are pretty strong Summation Royal Lancers are very strong so we'll go through and have a look um, so for Bobby he's got the uh, Summation Royal Lancers General with uh, Battle Rhythm and Second Wind is your gen skill he's got the uh, Summation Horseman there Steep Lancers with an upgrade, Steep Lancers all out the front by the looks of it. On the flanks, uh, Summation Horseman and the uh, Royal Lancers again. And he's got the Noble Lancers as his second line here. So he's looking to blunt the charge with the Steep Lancers. And then come in with the uh, Noble Lancers there. Out the back he's got the uh, couple of Armoured Lancers and uh, a couple more, well actually a uh, Horseman and the Royal Lancer out the back, so not a bad build at all. Very, very strong. And for Grill, got the uh, Step Lancers, crap load of them out the back, a couple of Armoureds there. Yep. Then in the front lines, the uh, Saka Cataphract Horse Archers, Horse Archers again. Horse Archers. So yeah, a very different line there. So Bobby's gone for the more uh, just normal cav, whereas I think Grill's gone for the Chitin build here. So and got the uh, Battle Rhythm and Second Wind as the Gen Skill as well. So I don't know how this is going to go because Bobby's going to have the um, Steep Lancers and to to be able to grab hold of these. Uh, uh, horse archers here, the second cataphract horse archers and armoured horse archers. So they won't be able to kite too good, but we'll see how he uses it. Bobby might um mightn't be able to catch them. So this is gonna be an interesting clash. Oh, I've got the noble lancer out the back there too, I didn't see in the woods. Just one of them but So Grill want to be careful bringing this um, army out too close because as I said the Stip Lancers will come in getting blundered by the other Armoured Lancers These... Oh, she's a good clash we'll Zoom along the middle and see how it's going Here comes the um, Noble Lancers now which will have a field day against them uh, just normal Stip Lancers there the armoured lancers. So you can see the armoured lancers going down quite heavily now. And these are uh, summation horsemen having a good time there too. So Bobby hasn't lost much of his uh, royal lancers there at all, or noble lancers. And these sacred cataphract horse archers just haven't got enough fire in to make it uh, viable at all so you can see now they're starting to chase after them I just don't know how that's going to go there got the noble answers coming in here for support good charge in there he had two noble answers actually just add another one hidden there very good Coming in to surprise his flank, try and overwhelm it and get some good shots in. So there's some good shots coming in now. But a bit of friendly fire will be happening as well. So these Noble Lancers have done well, 55 kills, not many losses. So starting to mop up this uh, right flank of Bobby's a bit. This, uh, the left flank has prevailed heavily and come through with a lot of troops left. 
and to kite that many troops I don't think it'll be able to do it for too long but we'll see how it goes could surprise me and get some uh, crucial shots off now that they're damaged a bit as well so but still full units almost 57 left out there so some good shots coming in but heavily depleting these uh, troops as you can see now the uh, Steep Noble Lancers are going down quite heavily focus fire on them Oof, some good shots coming in there so this uh, could be a good tactic by Grill Oop. No, the uh, cataphracts are getting caught and they're getting red line pinned. So you can see uh, once they hit the red line here, they're pretty derpy. You need to quickly get them out of here and move them off out of the red line. But these uh, Arbor Lancers, with their quick pace, have caught the cataphract horse archers and they haven't been able to get away. And then Bobby does the same here and pins them with the um, Sumatian horsemen. The quick units, like I said, are catching the um, horse archers so they can't kite very well and once they're caught they're not too good in melee a bit better than the Sumatian horsemen but still they take a long time to kill down and Bobby brings in support with the Royal Lancers so Grill caught out here with um, only about four horse archers left and Bobby has a, uh, a fair bit of troops left. As you can see here, the Royal Lancers. With the second wind ability too, because he can pop that on any kind of troop. So if he's got um, Sumatian Horsemen, they're a bit tired, he can pop the uh, second wind on them, and then they can easily catch these horse archers. The uh, Sucker Horse Archers. Cataphract's still going right here in melee against the uh, Royal Lancers, but once this blob here comes in, they will feel the pressure of that. Still got these quick armoured lancers that are coming in now. You can see how quick they are and how quick they're going to catch the um, Saka horse archers. So if Grill gets rid of uh, these quicker units like the armoured lancers and the uh, Sumatian horsemen could have a chance of uh, kiting away the rest of the troops here. Got these armoured lancers, uh, I mean armoured horse archers out here. They've done a bit of killing, got 34 kills. General's got 57. This uh, sucker cataphract got caught by the um, summation of horsemen here. They might be able to pull that engagement off, but Bobby realises and brings in his uh, general. Royal Lancers coming in for some good kills. I like these troops, how they got an axe. They look pretty cool. So if Bobby gets some good flanking shots in here, might make, I mean, um, if Grill gets some good flanking shots on Bobby's general, it might make a good difference. Hit the Draco ability. Getting some good shots in. It could hurt the general, but the general's still got 60 men left and an armor value of 90, so can afford to cop a few shots in the back there. And now, if uh, Grill's got the second wind ability available, now would be a good time to use it. Keep that general. Nice and fresh. Oh, it's still active, so it's not. There yeah, we go. It's hit the second wind now, so get them a bit of distance out of there. So these armored horse archers coming in for the Royal Lancers, but um, they're just going to get pinned by the other noble lancers and go down quite heavily. So it's just the general left now. He's been caught. Grill realizes it's a uh, futile kiting with one. Cav, so comes in for a valiant charge here. Last charge of the uh, heroic Saka horse archers. 
So a good game, very good game. Two different kind of tactics there. And um, yeah, Bobby played well with his uh, army choice here, I think. And as you can see, the, the noble answers with their high armor value and uh, great killing potential came out victorious in the end with a fair few kills. And you can see for Grill, his um, second cataphract horse archers did do a good job. 109 kills, 52, 43 for his uh, armoured horse archer. 106, but um, just had no staying power with the um, armoured lances, or the steep lances, or the um, nobles there. That Grill had three nobles, sorry, I must have missed one somewhere. They're all hidden, but um, yeah, they didn't have enough. Uh, yeah, noble lances, maybe a few more noble lances to hold up Bobby's, and uh, so he can get the good shots in. But you can see it was the idea behind the build was pretty good. Just needed a bit more holding power with a few more noble lances, but they are expensive, so going for the bulk to try and get more armored horse lances in there. So yes, good game by Bobby. Got um, 856 kills, lost 720. So you can see it was uh, still a tight game in the end. Uh, yep. So very good play by Bobby. So Bobby brings out the uh, victory in the tournament. That's uh, two nil, the best of three. So congratulations, Bobby, for the uh, faction band tournament win. Bet she's happy with that, <laughs> as I would be. So. Everyone uh, congratulate Bobby for his win. It was a well-earned victory. And I hope you enjoyed the uh, two battles here in the finals. And I uh, hope you enjoyed the, the replay. And I'll talk to you soon.